Okay, so I'm like uh, five jobs in this morning, and my leg would always usually be soaking wet. And the huge thing for me about that is, is I have leather seats, so I always put a towel down on my seat to prevent that. But this morning, I mean, this is literally the first day I've been using this, and I have no water on my leg. And I'm using a 22 inch mop. So I mean, every time I use a 22 inch mop with anything else, I have wet leg. And I really actually didn't think that was gonna be the case. I kind of thought that was gonna be something that actually wouldn't happen, and it's happening. So that's pretty cool. Let's talk about the bucket just a little bit here. So I just received this actually yesterday, and I always usually use the um, I always usually use the Mormon bucket on a belt. And I was using the gunslinger, but I actually was able to put both of those away today. And I'm going to use this, which I'm quite happy about. So, real quickly, if you want to take it off, you can take it off two ways. You can unbuckle it. Or you can take off the strap. tools that I've been using today have been uh, an 18 inch Flux Lumen Max, fits in super nice, and a combi, well and a accelerator with the pad. So, all you do is unclick it on the two sides and pull it out, right? That's the one for two squeegees on each side. This is the one for like a combination tool and a squeegee. Let it fall in. Click, click, it's in. It does not come out. And I really don't see these breaking very easily because you never really plant that thing unless it like fell from a high high height that's the only way you can see it and anything will break like that so unclick it do that I'm using the one now with the two squeegees put it back in boom boom it very very simple This thing fits super nice. I'll probably put it 
probably put it in like this. Boom. So it is uh, it's Friday, got done with work, it's raining, um, but I wanted to give my kind of last thoughts on my initial kind of review of the Samurai bucket on a belt. Um, overall, loved it. it. You will not have a wet leg whatsoever with it. Um, Squeegee's fitting great, High Flyer fits in great, Mower Man Accelerator fits in great with the flick pad. Every squeegee fits in great. The only thing that I just had to change on it was the strap was just too long. Um, so what I wind up doing was just making it a strap like that. Um, I just took off the buckle part and made it like that. So it just holds nicely on to the belt, tight to the belt, tight to your leg, just like any other bucket on a belt. I was just so used to the length of the mowerman, which is really right on your hip, that it was just starting to kind of um, irk me so I just decided that just to do that and make it like that and it works awesome um, I put a putty knife in the middle part and I've decided to go with the two squeegees um, like that I don't use my combinations tool so much that I have to have them on my belt I pretty much have them in my my bucket usually like a bucket of water so um, that was pretty much it but I mean, the biggest thing about this that I, that no other, no other bucket or any other contraption, the gunslinger can offer you is a dry leg when you get done with work. And this does it, this does it for you. So, you know, I'm gonna be using it over the whole entire summer and I'll have some more thoughts on it then. I'll be using it in my videos. Um, but you know, bucket on a belt, you can pretty much get the, the, full spectrum of it pretty quick so I feel like I have the idea of it and um, you know what it's gonna be like and uh, had no problems with with this coming out so no issues there um, 22 inch mop fit great I put a 24 inch super channel that fit great everything fit great I pretty much I'll use bigger channels sometimes but I, I really like to use just an 18 inch channel one mop and then have an 18 inch and a 14 inch for houses and then an extra 10 and then of course for French windows, you know, have whatever. But I actually find carrying more squeegees doesn't do me any better. It actually, I feel like complicates things. So I like to have one squeegee. There's not a question of which squeegee I'm gonna choose for a window. I just do it, get it done, that's it. So that's what I really like about this. And um, yeah, it's made in the USA. What other better can it be? And um, I'm just really looking forward to using this over the summer. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And we'll... Oh! I almost forgot. I almost forgot. There's a giveaway! There's a freaking giveaway! Oh my god. So, I'm gonna be giving away a samurai. A black samurai. Um, I'm not gonna take the strap off for you guys. You can decide whether you, what you wanna do on that. So you're gonna get a made in the USA Samurai, um, so you can thank Aztec Innovations, Jared Martinez for that, and um, he was the one that provided that for me to give away, and um, the contest will go on for a couple weeks. Um, I'll be gone for a little while, so I don't wanna do, I don't wanna have the contest in while I'm gone, because I won't be near a computer for a good, for a good over a week. So um, there's gonna be a giveaway and follow the Gleam contest in the description and you can win a free samurai, a black free samurai. So thanks for watching guys as always. I hope you all having a great season. I know we are and it's super, super busy, it's super, super fun. So um, remember to check out Window Clean Resources YouTube channel for videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from um, me, Tradman, Luke, Window Joe, the Window Clans, Fluff Daddy, and of course Jersey Josh on WCR Nation. And uh, talk to you guys later. Have a good night, or have a good morning, or have a good day. Peace.